Welcome to your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Be sure to check out your exclusive discount offer at the end of your free lesson. When you protect a worksheet, you prevent accidental or malicious changes to the worksheet. Once worksheet protection is in place, no one can change the locked cells until the worksheet protection is removed. Locked cells can be changed freely as long as the worksheet isn't protected, which is why you must first unlock the cells that you want to change before you apply spreadsheet protection. In Excel 97 and 2000, you can protect the contents, objects, and scenarios in a worksheet. In Excel XP in 2003, you have far more activity options, which will be displayed as several checkboxes that you can check to allow users to perform the activity. So you have more control over exactly what users can and can't do in those two versions. Optionally, you can also type a password that's required to be entered before the spreadsheet could be unprotected. And this option is also a little bit risky because if you forget the password, you're not going to be able to remove spreadsheet protection. To actually apply worksheet protection, select the worksheet to protect, and then select Tools from the menu bar, roll down to Protection, and choose Protect Sheet. This launches the Protect Sheet dialog box. And here you can check the checkboxes for the objects that you would like to protect if you're using Excel 97 or 2000, or just check the checkboxes for actions that you want the users to be able to accomplish if you're using Excel XP or 2003. When you're ready, note that you can put in the password to protect the sheet in the Password to Unprotect Sheet text box if desired, and then just click OK when you're finished. At this point, if you have a locked cell, it won't allow you to change the value. However, you can always change the value in your unlocked cells. Now when you want to unprotect a worksheet, you're going to remove the specified worksheet security. And to do this, choose Tools from the menu bar, roll back down to Protection, and choose Unprotect Sheet. If there's an associated password, it would then prompt you to enter it, and you'd have to click OK. After doing that, the spreadsheet would then be unprotected, allowing you to change any cell. Thank you. We hope you enjoyed your free video lesson from Teach You Comp Incorporated. Like what you see? Pick up your copy of our complete tutorial today and be sure to visit us at www.teachucomp.com slash YouTube for your special bonus offer. Our complete tutorial featuring introductory through advanced material is available on CD-ROM or digital download. You will receive our high-quality video lessons plus printable instruction manuals in one easy-to-use training package. With over two dozen titles to choose from, you'll be sure to find the training you need in Microsoft Office, QuickBooks, Photoshop, and much more. Visit us today!